Hi parents, this is Tony Knight, your superintendent. And after a very long time of being on distance learning throughout this pandemic, our county has informed us that the case rate has dropped below 25 cases per 100,000, which allows our schools to open in limited capacity for hybrid learning at the elementary level. So I've sent you a detailed email message about that with a lot of information about safety and the schedule, etc. And following my message is your principal with more of that type of information. And most importantly, just to welcome you and your child back to Oak Park Schools. So it's been a long time and um, it will be a transition for your children to come back onto our campuses. They will look different in terms of the safety protocols that will be in place. I wanted you to know that uh, we are exceeding all of the state, local, and federal guidance that's provided for schools to reopen. So we are opening them uh, in an atmosphere of safety and caution. And as a parent, I would expect that you would want to know that. Um, as we move forward, we're gonna ask you as your child returns to school to maintain extra safety precautions in your households with your family. So be careful about where you're going, limit exposure, follow all those guidelines with the masks and the hand washing, et cetera. And that will help us to keep everybody much safer in our schools. The virus doesn't know a boundary between the school and another, and another place. So that's gonna be very important. In the meantime, we're excited about welcoming your children. And on behalf of the Board of Education, thank you for all you're doing and have been doing in helping to educate your children. And we look forward that this hybrid model is the opening and the gateway to uh, fully opening our schools at some point later. Thank you very much. Hi, Brookside Tigers. Mrs. V here. We are so excited to welcome all of you back, but I'm sure you're probably wondering what your day is going to look like. So today I'm going to walk you through what a day looks like for a hybrid student at Brookside when you are on campus. We're going to go through some really important information, things about ways that we're going to keep you safe and make sure that everyone is staying safe while they're here on campus. Come and join me as we walk through what a day looks like when you are at Brookside. I want you all to know that we are so excited to have you on campus again. We are looking forward to it. We are ready to give you air high fives and air hugs. And it's really important that you do the same when you come back to campus. We have to make sure that we're following all of the social distancing guidelines and rules and procedures and making sure that everyone is staying really safe. We can't wait to see you. We look forward to a great rest of the year and take care Brook Brookside Tigers. See you soon. Good morning, Brookside Tigers and Brookside parents. Thank you so much for standing so nicely on the six foot sticker. Make sure that you're looking for our six foot, foot stickers all around campus. Stand on those patiently and wait your turn to go through our health screening process. As you walk up, look for the campus supervisor in their bright green vest. Wait for their directions. Make sure that you hand sanitize after you get your temperature taken. Additionally, we want to thank you for downloading the Parent Square app and making sure that you have followed the health screening process for your child before you come on campus. And then be sure to give an air high five or a, a hug and wave goodbye to mom or dad that's dropping you off. And then off you go to your designated line. It's very important to be sure that you have your mask on, covering both your mouth and your nose when you arrive on campus. This goes for parents and for students. Grace has found her spot. She looked for the blue X and is in line waiting for her teacher. At this time too, as you see new friends that are coming in and lining up behind you, it's a good time to give an air high five or an air hug. And friends, it's really important to make sure that we are staying six feet apart. And that's why these blue X's are six feet apart. So as you're sitting or standing on those X's, you can talk with your friends, you can give high fives, air high fives, and air hugs until your teacher arrives, but it's very important that you stay seated on those blue X's. And at this time, Grace, if you wanted to, you could have a seat on that X if you needed to wait for a little bit. Friends, as you enter your classroom, you will notice that desks are spread out. Half of your class will be with you in the classroom and the other half of your class will be learning from home. So you'll have opportunities throughout the day 
to be together as an entire class. Some of you will be at home and some of you will be in the classroom, but you'll still get to see each other. You'll notice that all of you will have your own set of materials, which you will keep under your desk and you will listen to your teacher's directions at the end of each day so that those things can be sanitized each day. Most of the activities will be done at your own desk, but at times we will also have you go outside and do some learning outside. We still have lots of fun and lots of work to do, but each time you enter and exit your classroom, you will be making sure you sanitize your hands. This is an example of what one of our outdoor learning spaces might look like. These stools can be moved all over campus and we will have a schedule that rotates through classes. But this is an example of what one of those spaces will look like. We are going to encourage students and teachers to work outside as often as possible and be sure that they are socially distanced by six feet while they are outside. Brookside Tigers, whenever you are coming to lunch, you have to make sure that you sanitize your hands before you come into the lunch space. If your class stable is assigned to this area, we have one person for each table. These tables can only fit one person at each table. Friends, if you are assigned to this lunch area, you need to make sure that you look for this, this tape on each side because that's gonna designate where you need to sit during your lunch time. If you notice, we have one here, one over here, and then we also have one right here. So we can fit three friends at each of our tables. The tables are also color coded, so this row is the yellow row. This row is the white row of tables. So if your class comes to this area, you need to make sure you look for that special spot where you sit, socially distanced from another friend. This row is the orange row. If your group is assigned to this area, you need to look for the orange tape. The orange tape shows where you sit during that time. You can also look for one of our socially distanced stickers that marks a six foot spot. During lunchtime, you will be signed to a table to eat your lunch. Please remember that you sit at each of the six foot markings. It is safe for you to take your mask off while you are eating. If you are buying a lunch, your lunch will be delivered to you at your tables. After you are eating, you will need to sanitize your hands and then play in your class assigned area. you are on the yard, some classes will have PE during this time and others will have free play. It will be important for you to stay in your designated zones and you will learn more about your zones from your teachers and our campus supervisors when you get back on campus. It's also important to remember that your mask must be kept on when you are outside during this playtime. Friends, when you're at school and you have your mask on, it's important that you know that you're going to see teachers and staff with their masks on. You might also see teachers with a mask and a shield. And this is what they would look like in that case. When the day is over, the teachers will walk their students out to their parents and pick up at the same gate that they dropped off at. All right, Brookside Tigers, we are so excited to be welcoming you back on campus. We are so anxious to see you and can't wait to get started. Let's make it a great rest of the school year.